touching it. Yeah, you made it so ugly. Photoshopping in a moving automobile is proven to be quite difficult. It is a talent though. It's definitely a talent. The only reason why I'm relatively even able the reason why I'm the reason why I'm only relatively able to do this is from all the years on the tour bus and when we have college shows having to rush and do that. But I'm trying to get the video from yesterday. If you didn't see it, a tornado hit literally a mile away from our house. It was crazy. It wasn't necessarily a really bad one to the sense that we got hurt. It ripped apart a couple of signs. It ripped, yeah, trees, trees and signs and poles. I never really, I mean, I've heard of Florida having hurt, uh, tornadoes, but I feel like, okay, the only thing we don't have now is earthquakes. And I think Allie was saying, they said the last Hurricane, torn I'm sorry, I keep saying hurricane because it's so common. The last tornado was like 2013 and it was just a water spout. It wasn't like what that was. And it was a touch and go water spout. You guys don't know what that is? It's just a hurricane in water, which is much better than anything unless you're a boat. This is true dedication right here. We are going to the morning market. Charles is bringing his computer with him so that we can upload this vlog. The worst situation I've ever had was I was in London, thrice last show ever. We got invited to go hang out with the guys and <laughs> I couldn't do it because the video wouldn't upload because I love you London, but your internet sucks. So I had to walk around going from hotel to hotel and I literally had to buy a room just to sit outside the lobby. Not even kidding, that's a true story. Hotel number two. She's trying the hard line, I'm trying the Wi-Fi. All day trying to find the little hot spots and stuff like this. We finally get back to the internet here at the hotel and it's blazing. It's... I throw my computer out the window, but I know I shouldn't. Well, I'm so excited because we have not been to the morning market in forever because it's been too hot. And so they just started it up like a little bit ago, right? Something like that. Melissa called us this morning and she's like, do you guys want to go to the morning market? And of course, we said yes. And of course. And of we're course. We're late. But that's okay because it's still going on and it looks like it's pretty busy. 5%. Yay! Hey, Banners, how are you doing, bud? He's like, I don't know if I like this. I don't know. <laughs> he needs a new bandana. Yes, he does. I saw. Did he eat that or did it just rip? It ripped. He had to wear flannel today. He did. It's very fitting. It's like so the first official day eat, of winter. Did he, <laughs> he eat half of it? Probably. <laughs> they have gourmet deviled eggs. I didn't know you can have that gourmet. You can, babe. What are you doing, buddy? You trying to get that off? Just like Zoe? I'll scratch it, but you got to keep that on, pal. Your mom will kill me. Please take it off. Please. <laughs> I know our bow wow brownie can be a little intimidating. <laughs> oh, he'll eat it. He's been very picky lately. Try it, it's plant based. You gotta try Is it pretty good? Like it? Um, yeah, it's really good. I've okay. never had yeah. plant based ice cream. Seen it all. Melissa, you are looking so pretty. Look at you and your hair. Do you're I look so thinner? Like I've lost a half of my face. You look gorgeous, darling. Gorgeous. Go Charles, I know you're very excited about Girls' well, Day 2018. She's got a new phone, so it's nice and smooth. Okay, so he has something to talk to. There's such a, something <laughs> smooth. Don't give. Don't ruin it. He's touching it. You're, you made it so ugly. Melissa got me a new one, so it's like a wallet, so I look yeah, like a dad. Now. And that's how he repays me. Oh, hello. I did tell you. Oh, kisses right to the camera. Taking next hour of sleep tonight. Is it Daylight tonight? savings. Oh, Daylight savings. I thought it was the fourth. Oh, hello. <laughs> Say the fourth? No, it's, it's the third, but tomorrow's the fourth. Oh, that day. Change the but, as, as Cher would say, if I could turn back time. <laughs> <laughs> That's tonight. We're going to play it when we turn back our clock. Sad thing, jeans there, babe. I know. You look like me right now. I love these jeans. I uh, made the mistake of wearing the wrong socks for these shoes, and now I have a blister. It hurts. That's how you're walking. <laughs> Might as well get you some Crocs or something. That sounds comfortable, actually. Yeah, it really honestly does. You guys remember that one time where we took over that Croc store in New York City? And you guys, yeah, we took over a Croc store. Actually, I think we might have a clip for that. Totally just MacGyvered in. Oh, then there. Hi. This is so weird. We're like, I want to get out of here. 
That was a long time ago. I wonder if you guys remember. Nope. 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 Way too soon. Nope. You know what I'm just realizing too? Like, we had Rika. She didn't understand the concept of actual climbing, like cat things. But now that we have Luna, she's starting to pay attention and pick up on these little tendencies. You guys saw yesterday, Luna was on top of the mattress when we were moving in. So that means I'm a little afraid that she's going to climb the Christmas tree. Do you think Luna's going to climb the Christmas tree? Mm-hmm. I, I honestly, after okay. seeing that mattress climb, what we're trying to do is figure out what the paint behind the door. Allie had a really good idea to do that chalkboard paint. She were to buy paint and it is to buy accessories for the And then we can do that like chalkboard paint and then Allie can paint something cool on the actual thing itself. Because you don't want me doing it. If I do it, it's going to look pretty bad. Oh, now you got all, you got all of them. Oh my god, I have to get them all a piece of this. This is just ridiculous. The only one that doesn't like it is Rika. Gentle. Don't be mean to me. Don't swat out my hand. Little brat. Jesus. Mm. She's a Marley. She's a cat version of Marley. <laughs> Gentle. See? Gentle. Same thing. Gentle. Thank you. Diesel's being all good back there. Gentle. Rika! Ricky! I hear you. Come on, baby. There she is. Yeah. This was before Luna. R Rika just started turning into this like cranky cat. She's not cranky, she just... Like more skittish, which is so weird because she was never like that. And this was way before we got Luna. And she's actually a little bit better now yeah. she has Luna because she's actually coming out and playing. But it's so weird because she used to be all about that. Now she's just like, meh, do, do my own thing. I'm gonna go sleep over here. What a waste. I know, I hate that stuff where it just. What do you want? All the political stuff, just wasting paper. Oh, speaking of which, I wanna take a, like a tally in the comments and in the eye. How many people right now are getting those annoying, like, political texts right this? now? Like, I feel like that's the new, like, Email spam is people are just like constantly getting spammed on my text messages now. Struggle is real, people. This is why I never put screen protectors on my freaking screen because they just get the stupid ass anger out of me now. <laughs> I'm trying to do this for probably 10 minutes. I'd rather just risk breaking my glass. Maybe you should use a card. Not because it won't do it. Saturdays are struggling day. For Charles Trippy. Hey, honey, do you want me to sing you a song? Because I know you love my voice. Why don't you put a smile on your face? Make the world a better place. Smile on your face. What you gonna do? To what you gonna do? I love how I kind of like did like the, what was it? Like a boogaloo. No, the hooting the blowfish. Kind of twang. Make the world a better place. One thing that Charles Trippy fails at is putting a glass cover on his phone. Yeah, it's so simple. Patience is a virtue, my love. So while my husband is trying to figure that out, I thought I would show you guys our celery. It's growing like crazy, which is so awesome. You want to come back in? Oh no, you just want me to come out. But it's growing so much since we planted it. And people said I couldn't grow plants. Actually, I said I couldn't grow plants. But look at all of these. They're all growing so well. My little babies. I'm so happy. I don't want to jinx myself, but I'm doing pretty good with growing plants. Actually, I'm growing food, which makes it even better. It's not just a visual thing. It's something that's actually going to provide us food and energy and fill us up in the morning. Makes me feel pretty good. Honey, I didn't kill the celery plants. I planted them. I thought that I would kind of let you guys in on what we're doing. We were just gonna like paint the walls, try and make something look a little bit new and a little bit more fresh. We've been thinking about it for a while. So what we did is we got this paint. So you can't, can you see that color? Looks a little bit darker on camera, but what we're gonna do is paint this wall in the chalk paint, which I thought would be kind of a cool little entrance area. And if you guys haven't heard of chalk paint, it's literally like a chalkboard. You can do it in almost any color that you want. You can get it tinted, which is something that I wasn't aware of until just recently. I'm thinking what we're gonna do is we're gonna do this area. So you know how we did the stairs? Well, we have to redo the stairs because you can see that the paint's chipping a little bit but we're gonna paint this a different color. And I think that what we're gonna do is we're gonna go with kind of a darker gray, not too much darker than this color, but a little bit darker so it kind of makes it stand out and it's gonna go all up in here, all there, all down this hallway. I think it's gonna look pretty red. Come on, bud. Come on, go 
off slow. But my old man is my shadow. And it only costs us like $30, which is even crazier. But I wanted to show you guys a couple ideas of what we had in regards to that wall. If I can find the colors that we looked at when we went to the depot of the home. I'm stupid, I shouldn't even be talking right now. You know what, hang on. You know what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put them on the wall so you guys can actually see them on the wall and then you guys can help us figure out what color you think would be best for that area. All right guys, so this is where I think you guys are gonna actually think we are completely insane and I don't blame you. These were like the colors that we were leaning towards, which it's not that much different than the color we have now, but I still think that it will, you know, especially with the brown, it's gonna look cool, it's gonna look nice. We threw in some dark grays here, but I think it's gonna be too dark, but here's the part where Char and I think that you guys might think that we're crazy, and we might actually be a little crazy for thinking this, but I think if we did one of these super dark tones, it would be super cohesive with a lot of things that we have downstairs. However, once you go dark, it's really hard to take away, and you can't really like change your mind after you do it. So these are some of the dark tones that we liked, which is, this one kind of reminds me of a chalkboard more, like downstairs. This is a little bit more bluer. This is a really, really dark, dark color, which I think might be too dark. And then we got these two lighter ones. So what do you guys think? Should we go super light or super, super dark in this area? And I should probably pick up my phone, right? Number one rule when vlogging, always check the camera for a battery or SD card. I've been gone for, I don't know, a couple hours now. The entire time, I forgot my entire battery I guess not the entire battery. I just forgot the battery in this camera. I'm an idiot. I've only done that maybe twice. This would probably be my second or maybe third time in my YouTube career that I've ever done that. Hey, Luna. Luna's in trouble. I have to start picking up, yeah, her. She's in trouble. She's starting to, to do her cat things around the house. Basically pooping everywhere, just being gross. So I don't know if you guys have any like tips or tricks on how to make a cat not be a cat and do that kind of stuff. We have like the vinegar, we got the, um, the, the baking soda or baking powder and you do all that stuff. So we, we're going the whole natural route and then we have that nature spray or whatever the heck it is. I don't know. The whole cat thing is all new to me, new to us. That is bad to do, you don't do that. Don't walk away from me. See if I talk to Zoe like that, Zoe, that is bad. She doesn't run away from me because she's a dog and dogs are awesome. Not to spark that whole cat versus dog debate, but I don't know, oh my God. I am desperately needing help from you guys right now. Please give me all your tips and tricks on how to rectify this situation. We got a standoff going on right now. Look at Rika's fat little belly dangling now. <laughs> Do something, you guys are boring. Thank you, all right. All right, go back to doing something. Rika, go play. Luna, go play. My attention's only gonna last so long, guys. Look at that belly. Look at that big old belly. I do wanna say thank you to a bunch of the CTFXC patrons so far for November, right here. Where I think we're going on a year now on Patreon. I think in December, we'll have one year of the Patreon CTFXC family, which is crazy, it's already been a year. That's honestly, that's mind blowing that's already been a year. But I just wanna say thank you to a lot of you guys. You've been there since the beginning. All you new ones joining, I love sending out all the Polaroids and seeing new names and stuff like that. So if you guys are interested, go check it out, links in the description, and please let me know on how to correct the situation with crazy lunatic, get it? Luna, lunatic, that's where it all came. Did I just blow your brain? That's, that's where it all came from. All right, see you guys tomorrow, bye.